Daddy, where are we today? We're at Karkik Park in like Northwest Seattle. What are we gonna do, Piper? Uh, get some seashells. Let's find some seashells. I I'm gonna put them in here. I'm gonna put them in our little tubes we got. All right, we're excited. We're getting out this Saturday. We're really trying hard to get out every Saturday because we don't have that many while we're here. Almost there. Almost there. Yeah. That one is too tight. It's flying. Oh, I hear the train coming. Corner. Oh man, we made it out of the green seaweed land, Piper. Oh yucky seaweed land. Whoa. Corner, you like the seaweed, right? No, I don't. <laughs> so we're at Karkik Park and uh, it's low tide this weekend and so normally the water's like way up by the rocks and they also have this awesome train track right by the park. Here it comes. Oh, you're gonna love trains. <laughs> What is that? It's a seashell. That is a seashell, Dada. That is a seashell. That? that is a seashell. Hey, is it dead or alive? It's definitely dead. I think it's alive. Why do you think it's alive? Wow, it's alive! Ah! Oh. <laughs> Dada, you want to see it? Wow, what's wrong with it? I think it's mostly dead. I could have thought it was dead because it has like barnacles I know. growing all in its back. I know. I think it's mostly dead. Porter loves crabs. He really likes them. Ever since Moana came out. Right? <laughs> well, I don't want to do crabs. Wait, talk to me. What are you saying? Oh, look at that pretty one. Get it. Why? It's so pretty. It's like blue. Here, I'll hold your thing. You get it. Okay, go get it. Oh, it doesn't fit? Oh, it fits, yay! It started like spouting water. Oh, yeah. That's something. What is it? Porter, what's in your uh, tube? Nothing. What? Why don't you have anything in it? Because. Why? Because. You, you're grossed out by it more than you want to keep it? Yes. I'm grossed out. Of it. Oh, our at home. Ah, uh, now we're gonna get some lunch. We're done with the beach. Our kids don't do beaches like really good <laughs> in short periods of time. Like Piper needs a day or two to get used to it and then she can like enjoy it and she won't want to leave it. But it was really fun. Beautiful day here in Seattle. We're loving it. Gonna go get some lunch. Good job, Piper. You're so strong. Oh, look at that puppy dog. Oh, it's so cute. Now I have one. Your one shell. Yeah, my one Good job, high five. <laughs> So we're taking a little break. I needed to feed Bo, and the kids went to go play in the playground, and then he needed a diaper change. So, all done with that. Woohoo! Yay! This guy is my favorite. Mmm, I mean, he's my favorite baby. He's just so happy right now. He loves being outside. He's five months now. 
And uh, yeah, he just loves being outside and we really love having him. You know, when my family's coming back though, I told them 10 minutes, that was like, it's been like 20. to make the long walk back to our car. Why do we need to learn how to walk long? Because it's from Disneyland. I told Porter we have to learn and practice how to walk for a long time so that we can go to Disneyland. <laughs> Everything we do is to get us to Disneyland. about this in a previous vlog just the whole getting your kids all up and dressed and packed and food and snacks and and strollers and carriers and everything that you need for like a little half day trip like this or a whole day trip just anything with kids takes so much effort sometimes it's like is this worth it is this even fun because it's so <laughs> they either end up getting dirty or wet or uncomfortable or they're complaining the whole time or Whatever it is, sometimes going out with kids is not as like fun as I as I see it in my brain. What did you like about uh, the beach? Nothing. I did not like the crabs. <laughs> but did you have fun at least with yes. us? Yes. Yeah. You guys went and played on the park for a little bit. Yeah. It was, it was a beautiful day outside. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. But don't worry, parents. You're still doing an A-plus job. And even if your kids don't like the activity you planned, they're crying the whole time, or they get like seriously injured during some fun activity that you planned, you're doing a great job. And you have to do these things. Because if you don't get out and do these things, life is much worse. Like if we would have just stayed in all day, all morning, and just like sat around and did that like every every Saturday, like it's just no fun. Part of having a happy family is wholesome recreational activity together. I actually really do believe that. So get out with your family and have fun because that's how families are happy. That's, that's where happy families happen is when you're actually doing fun things together and you learn more about each other. Like now I know Porter doesn't really like crabs even though he says he does. Do this. Oh, gross. Check out this Ew, cool... Ew, hairy. Oh, I know it has hair gross. on it. Show it, show it. We found this super cool crab claw and it like you can see how it I don't know if I like, got this on camera, but Zach like you scared Piper with it. You can see Piper how it like it. bends and stuff. It's really cool. <laughs> Piper freaked out when I like pretended to throw it on her real quick. <laughs> she was like, "No!" Okay, this is the end of the vlog. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment.